excited to get into this i am really just really excited for the new year to be honest i know there are so many blessings and just so much waiting for me in the future the near future all year i just know i just know i just know don't even ask i just know i'm feeling this 2019 energy right now and i really want y'all to feel it with me because i feel like everyone is but at the same time i feel like there's some people that are still slowly gradually coming into it because they're still on that 2018 energy and we need to leave that behind because that's not what we're on that's not the type of time we're on we're on some 2019 time we're on this new energy not the old wave we're not doing that no more so i'm just gonna run through a couple motivational tips for the year and i hope you guys enjoy it because i i actually kind of put a lot into this and writing everything down in my notes i even drew little pictures and stuff so Let's get into it. So first thing I need for everyone to do, I need y'all to remember all the other New Year's that you've had. All the times that you've been like, yep, this year I'm gonna start going to the gym and this year I'm gonna find this and I'm gonna do this. So I'm gonna get this and A, B, C, D. I need you to throw all of that out of the window and stop making re New Year's resolutions because it doesn't ever happen. Because you always put these things out there, you don't make it happen. 90% of the time people make New Year's resolutions and then realize halfway through the year that they didn't do anything about it. And then they go into the next year redoing that same resolution and adding something else on top of it and you never get it done and we're gonna stop that because this is the year where we put things in motion we're doing things this year 2019 is a whole new beginning this is a whole new year do you feel this 2019 energy it's serious this is the year to take care of yourself mind body and soul this is the year to actually put your plans in motion this is the year to make things happen because it's gonna happen for you I need y'all to stop talking about what you're gonna do and just do it. Don't go out here on social media like, yeah, I'm gonna go do A, B, C, D. Just go do it. You don't gotta tell everybody your game plan. You don't have to ask everybody's opinion. Just do it. Make it happen now. Why not do it now? Take care of it. Get into it. 2019 is the year to rise and grind. There's so many things that you could do in one day that you could accomplish from point A to point B. The limit is unimaginable of what you could do. So why are you wasting your time? You know that project you wanted to start? Start it. You have time. You know that test that you've been meaning to retake? Go take it. There's no better time than the present. You know that photo shoot that you wanted to have with your friends? Call your friend and ask if they're busy right now because you could be doing it. You know that job that you wanted to get but you never called? How about you call? You need to actually work towards your goals, not just set goals. Because you're not going to get anywhere if you just set a goal and that's it. You need a game plan. You don't have to tell everyone your game plan. You don't have to tell everyone your goal. It's the year to put our minds to work and put our words in motion it's time to grind also this is the year of self-care 100 percent self-care and this is something that is extremely important to me and i feel like it should be to a lot of people you should want to take care of yourself you need to put yourself first your mental emotional and physical well-being should be above anything else and that should be your main priority because if that's not in order you, what are you gonna be putting in motion? You need to love and believe in yourself 10 times more than anyone has ever told you that they do. You need to be your main supporter or else you're not gonna be putting your full energy and your full heart into what you're doing. You have to believe in yourself to the utmost extent and beyond. <laughs> this is the year to put yourself first, to love yourself, to wake up every morning and tell yourself that you're the shit. We need to remember that, yes, we all have struggles and we all go through it. Maybe we didn't have the best year and maybe we had a, a rough patch and we've been going through for a long time, but it's time to put that negative energy behind us. We need to accept the fact that, yes, these things happen, but you wouldn't be who you are if those things didn't happen. 
if you didn't go through all that trauma, if you didn't get hurt all those times, you wouldn't be who you are today. And I'm blessed. I am absolutely blessed to have been through so much shit in my life because it's made me who I am today. And I'm proud of who I am today. I don't care what struggles I have gone through. I don't care what struggles I'm going through now. I'm still proud of the woman that I am today. And we're gonna grind. We are gonna grind. We are gonna grind. If you don't know where to start, do some research. There's so many little things that you can do every day to make something so much better. Just simply looking at yourself in the mirror and telling yourself that you're beautiful or that you're handsome is amazing in itself that you feel strongly and you can tell yourself that. We need to leave all of the negative energy that people have had towards us and that we've had towards ourselves because we are ourselves. We are our own worst critic. All that negative energy that we keep criticizing ourselves about, gone. All the negative energy that you hear people talking about you, gone. It doesn't even matter anymore because this is a whole new year. All those toxic relationships, gone. All those fake friends, gone. The nigga that wasn't texting you, gone. Who needs to worry about that? You need to turn all that negative energy around and turn it into healing. Heal yourself. Take that time that you need for yourself and then start grinding. You cannot love anyone if you don't love yourself. I'm not happy, but at the same time, I'm very happy that I'm in the situation that I am because that gives me so much time to work on myself. There's so much room to take care of myself in this year, it's not even funny, and I'm so excited to take this journey and especially bring you guys along because this is something I wanna do with you. I wanna show you that you can do it. This is the year, this is the the year of new beginnings 2018 prepared you for this you're ready i don't care how unprepared you feel you're ready you are put yourself first if something in your life is not beneficial to you then what is it doing it's wasting your time it's wasting it's wasting your time out of these 365 days that we have to grind and also don't let anybody influence you this is the year to be you be your own person and speak your own mind. You don't always have to go to this person for their advice and then maybe it sways you to this side. Do what your gut feeling tells you to do because I guarantee you that's the right decision. It's time to let your mind be free and be open with yourself and just love yourself and take care of yourself. It's a, This is a year. This is the year for all of those good things that you've always wanted for yourself to happen, to happen. We're gonna start this year off right and trust me, we're going to be completely unstoppable because this is our year, period. There's nothing else for me to say, but this is our year, so let's get it.